When I was 11 years old, I hit my left eye on the side of a swimming pool. And by the age of 14, I became totally blind. And when I became blind, I faced two major obstacles for the blind. One was obtaining information. In those days, there were no personal computers, no internet, no smartphones. So I couldn't read any book by myself. Another difficulty was mobility. I couldn't go anywhere by myself. That became my strong need and pushed me and ignited me uh, to innovate new technologies. Now my research focus is the development of AI suitcase. So the idea of the AI suitcase came from my own personal experiences. I travel alone with a suitcase frequently. And one day I noticed uh, it's very difficult to carry a suitcase and white cane together at the airport. So I thought if we can integrate uh, AI, perception, control and planning into a suitcase, it's going to be my new travel companion. We just hold a handle of the suitcase and the suitcase robot will take us to the destination. It means we can enjoy surroundings like, you know, oh, it's a nice weather today or oh, I can hear the good music, you know, I don't have to worry if someone is, you know, coming in front of me or oh, there might be some trash can in front of me, you know. We don't have to worry anything about related to collision. So it will change our mobility experiences. In the future, we see lots of robots helping people with disabilities. In this way, we can narrow the gap between people with disability and people without disability. And I hope a robot like AI Suitcase will contribute to narrow the gap to realize diversity, equity, and inclusion.